Black Talk Live. It's great to have you with us. It's National Spaghetti Day, and we're about to feed our pasta fix. Yeah, Chef Luigi is here to show us how to twist up our spaghetti by adding clams. Mm -hmm. I have to bon show your jacket. Bon I love bon your jacket, by Pasta the way. all over. Pasta. We have a spaghetti over here. We have a farfalle over here. Viva la pasta. So Viva la pasta. I like what are we it. making here today? Okay, today, because it's a National Spaghetti Day, we mm -hmm. have this beautiful spaghetti, of course, the grano duro, like hard wick, okay. with the vongole. Vongole, clams, mm. beautiful. Look how fresh they are. Right. So how do how you see when they are fresh? Beautiful, the color like that. And then, of course, they have to be closed. Oh. If you see any open, which we don't have over here, or even when you cook them, take it away, because if they don't open, that means they are dead. Or if oh. they are crackled a bit, you don't want to use that one. I did not okay. know Either that. they are dead or they are full of sand, which you definitely don't want to have. Don't want sand exactly. in my pasta. Okay. So the best way to do how to treat it, mm -hmm. you wash very well. If you scrub a little bit, if you can. Mm -hmm. If not, you change the water a couple of times. And then, of course, a simple, nice, fresh garlic. You cannot <laughs> Mr. the extra virgin olive oil, you saute like this one, right. and now we're going to add so the spaghetti. Literally right. just garlic yeah. and olive oil. An olive Absolutely. Oil. You cut the garlic okay. very thin like this one, okay. Okay. then you golden with olive oil. Immediately you put the clams, you cover eventually, so with the steam they open. And that's what makes it open. Exactly. Okay. So how long do you cover them for? Uh, it takes uh, like uh, three to four minutes, so, so okay. it's like, you know, fresh, usually they open immediately. Mm -hmm. And then uh, the parsley, but you don't want to have the parsley, you don't want to cook the parsley. Once you saute it, right now, for example, we, we already saute the clams, okay. because on TV everything is, you know, you yeah. have to be right, fast it and so beautiful. Fast. Okay. So the, the little bit of uh, parsley, and now we have the spaghetti. Absolutely Ooh. al dente, which we're oh, going to toss over here, like that and so we do the magic one oh. like this. Wow. Unfortunately, at home you cannot smell it, but it's fantastic. It smells it so good. Oh, it's fantastic. I can guarantee you it's fantastic. And you serve it the shell and all. You sell it the shell and all. That's the beautiful things, because this is the clams, the most beautiful perfume one. They're not so big, but it's an explosion of the taste. Sometimes the big, they are more like, probably have a little bit more meat inside, mm -hmm. but in terms of the taste, it is totally uncomparable. So, Chef Luigi, how do you, how do you eat this ladylike now? Because you got the shells there. I thought you would, like, clean them you up. You thought it would be de-shelled okay. for you? Yes, I That's thought it would be de-shelled. Look. It's not worry, I need a shell. Like this. Look okay. at this. You take the Immediately, oh, and you it take the kinda, right. it's take the shell Because this one, see, when mm -hmm. I saute, even it come up. But wow. you want to saute with the shells because it gives you more flavor. More flavor. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if you take that one out, even the flavor goes away because mm -hmm. this part over here, once you saute, once you toss it, it gives it the explosion. It elevated the taste of the, the spaghetti or the linguine that you will use for this. And there's no other sauce or anything. This is just no. the olive, uh, olive oil smell and it, garlic. Smell it. Mm -hmm. So we traditionally okay. think of spaghetti with a red sauce. Yeah. Where did you come up with this recipe and decide to put it on the Well, measure? this is a classic. This is a spaghetti vongoli. in most any area, or any Riviera that you go in Italy or anywhere, mm -hmm. that's where it's the symbol. Remember, the fish, as simple is better. Even Escoffier used to say that. The simplicity is like the best ingredient that you have. Why? Because garlic and olive oil elevated the taste. Mm -hmm. If you put a sauce, if you put a tomato, mushrooms, mm -hmm. or cream, you kill it. Right. What if we focus over here we focus on the freshness of, of the, the taste of the clams. Right. If we had the more ingredient, we actually kill them. So why? We want to have this precious flavor and items to enjoy. Well, you're speaking of flavor. Better. What kind of wine would you serve with that? White wine with a lot of acidity. Okay. Uh, for example, you do a terroir. Wherever you are, they have a white wine in that area, so mm -hmm. you're not going wrong with that one. But again, as long as it's a, you know, like a Falangina, talking about Italy, or Greco di Tufo, Fiano, Sancerre, for friends, it would be perfect mm -hmm. because you know, as long as it has acidity, as long as it elevated, you know, don't overpower it, it's fantastic. Okay. And this is a pretty easy recipe that people it can is. make at home if yeah. they want to. It's an authentic You can Italian find, dish. of course, if you call here today and ask for the recipe, you will find it. But most importantly, you will find my cookbook. Too. Oh, yeah. There you go. Oh, that's right. You said the, the new cookbook. Yes, exactly. Um, I think it was like six, seven years ago, uh, the Washington Post did the survey, and this Linguine Voncole was one of the top five best editions in this. Mm. Mm. But I cannot take it that much credit because, again, it's Mother Nature who provides us with these beautiful clams, mm -hmm. and that's what it's all about. The secret is like a, the quality of an ingredient. Any chef, anybody who cooks at home, 
as long as you find the great ingredient, you have 50% of your job done. Is this a good season for clams? Yes, it is. It okay. is yes. And where can people get the cookbook? At Tiramisu or at uh, artiramisu.com. And you find that you can buy online or you can buy at Tiramisu. Maybe I'll give you a little dessert and you buy the book. Oh, there you go. Ooh, yeah, that's a good added that, value. That is absolutely. So I like people it. should come to the restaurant today for... For uh, your new resolution. So we still have a new year. So, uh -huh. so yeah. that's what you need. It. And, and this is, yeah, this is locale because, you, like you said, olive oil and garlic, the noodles and the clam. Exactly. Yeah, probably you have not even 400. I mean, because it's simple and it's rich in terms of flavor. It's really like, the, when, when you eat these dishes after the first or the second bite, you feel like, ah, mm. if there was an extra spoon, I will take it. <laughs> That's what you want to have because it, it doesn't fill you up like, like this. It's actually freshness and you are mm -hmm. active immediately later with a lot of energy to spend. Excellent. I like it. Thanks, Chef, for coming in this morning. Thank, Thank you. My pleasure. Thank, Thank you so much. We love the, what is yeah. this again? Pasta, little bow tie pasta. Farfalle, always al dente. There you go. <laughs> I All love right, it. coming up.